first of two meetings between these two. They'll play again in the new year in New York. But tonight they're in Vancouver and we're underway with Keandre Miller paired on defense with Jacob Truba. Over to Hughes. This could all be for naught because the puck, I think, might have come outside the line. It was really yeah. close. It was shot by Besser, but he healed it. And Shesterkin was able to steer it into the corner. Now it's a moot point as Adam Fox clears the puck down the ice. Yeah, the players... And it's Ooh, the Rangers nice. getting their first power play. That's linesman Jonathan Deschamps, who took a tumble. Went down hard. Here's the advantage. And oh, tipped off the post by Kreider. Dust himself off, and this is the quick little shot in a set play. And look at that redirection short side by Kreider. Set play, and he just knifed it short side, but it hit the iron. I don't know if there's anybody better in the league than Chris Kreider redirecting pucks around the net. Now here's Trocek for the crease, stopped by DeSmith. Joshua in the box. Veronica's has joined it. Hughes gets the puck off the draw. Gloved down by Panarin at the right point. He controls, dishes off, gets a return pass from Zibanejad. And now one timer from Zibanejad, and he hit the post too. 92 miles from Mika Zibanejad. Two posts for the Rangers already. He's got the puck again. Zibanejad to the side, and that hit the side of the net. Tyler Myers, good job to shield the puck, and he puts it off the boards and down the ice. Here a lot of iron being hit in succession. The post by Kreider, that blast by Zibanejad, and the short side by Panarin hits the side of the net. Here's Zibanejad in again. Puts one to the middle. Trocek checked by Miller. Panarin gets the puck. 25 seconds to go in the first penalty. Panarin shoots. He scores! Kreider was in front. I don't know if he got a piece of it. The shot from Panarin and the Rangers on the two-man advantage open the scoring. So a shot mentality early on and a couple real quick plays to the net. This time, good entry. Find the bouncing puck and you're going to see Panarin walk in and he sees layers. And as soon as he sees the Smith, look around Ian Cole to the left. Where does he shoot it? To the right side of the net his left side but he beats the smith as he's looking left he goes on the opposite and buries that one just a quick little wrister and a heads up play by and you're from winnipeg scott so now everybody says well, what about dale howard well of course the old jets records belong to the team down in arizona under a minute to go on the power play panarin stays out Drops off to Zibanejad, who steps in on the left wing with speed, puts it on the forehand, left pad saved by DeSmith. Way end to end action, here's this good pad save by Casey. And here's Hughes, down to Pedersen. Quinn Hughes, JT Miller, puts it in front! Tip by Kuzmik with the best of the rebound, put it right into the pads! Yeah, Miller really hanging high here, he likes to kind of come from high to low with speed, shoot it great from there, but he's looking for the redirection, Kuzmenko with that stick just planted on the ice as a target. Doesn't get quite the redirection that he wants. Besser in front. It's just Sturkin that actually kicks it loose again. And then Besser. Pedersen goes down. Puck comes back to Hirona. Ten seconds to go in the power. But it's a mishmash of players out there now. Pedersen back to Hirona. Fakes the shot. Now lets it go. He scores! <laughs> Did JT Miller get a piece of that one as Hironic threw it on goal? They've been all over the Rangers, retrieving pucks, attempting shots, but getting it back. And then the wrister by Hironic, the double clutch, the fake slapper, and then just get it through. And you can see the celebration in front by Miller. Look at this. Better angle right there. It's the high wrister. Get him. Quinn Hughes, Philip Hironic on defense, a 1 1 tie. With both teams looking to improve on their five and two records. Trocek sidesteps two Canucks. Puck comes to the right point. Adam Fox checked, gets it back. Fox attacking from the side. Sharp angle shot off the pads at the Smith. Now Fox is trapped a little bit, but Hoaglander towards the end of a shift is going to be content to play the puck in and allow his line mates to get to the bench. Trying to buy some time by pressuring the Rangers deep in their own zone. Wheeler gives it away to Garland. Long wrist shot. Stopped by Sisterkin. He got his stick on that one. Rangers one for three on the power play. They scored on a two-man advantage in the first. Now Myers breaks it up. He's two on one with Lafferty. Tyler Myers to the net. Scores! And then Tyler Myers with a pickoff right on the defensive line. 
on that attempted pass wide and results in a two-on-one. Lafferty opens up. He's a threat as a one-timer. Right shot, left side. And then the patience, just a wait and hold. Looks like Fox takes it away. Passes to the side of the goal. Went over the stick of Fox. Panarin gets the puck. Artemi Panarin. Down to Fox. Back up to Panarin. Shoots. Blocked. Ian Cole got in front of it. 25 seconds to go in the first penalty. Panarin to the side, tipped in. Adam Fox able to roof that one. Another goal with a two-man advantage, and the Rangers have tied it at two. And guess who again? It's Panarin with the shot attempt. Nice block on the first attempt as he's going far side. Would have been a tough save. It's block comes out. This one right here, you could see the Smith was moving right. It was going the opposite side. But then this one here just kind of walks in, buys his time, and the shot pass the defenseman Adam Fox gets right to the net what a redirection watch how in tight he has to kind of shovel this one upstairs a good job just to get down low Adam Fox goal and Aaron with a goal and an assist Savannah Jan has a couple of assists in this game Rangers set up again in the Vancouver zone Fox at the blue line Savannah Jan one timer blocked by DiGiuseppe Kreider Sends the puck around to the near side. Just under a minute to go in the power play. Here's Fox. Gets just his advantage at. He whistled it wide. Puck kept in by Panarin. Artemi Panarin, wrist shot, missed the net. Puck loose behind the goal. Trocek finds it. Trocek banks it back to Zavanna Now Panarin. Watched by Miller. To the side. Kreider in front. Loose puck. Hit the post. Now another chance. They score. Savanna His first goal of the year. Mika Zibanejad gives the Rangers the lead again. It's 3-2 New York. It's a beautiful pass across after all this confusion. You're going to see this puck come down. Panarin up in the high spot on this power play. A redirection one time. And it's, watch this play here as it gets across by Fox. That one-touch pass through to Zibanejad through all that traffic. Shuffles it over. And that's a defenseman playing right down in the zone. He's the one that scored the goal to make it 2-2, and he's right in the action again. Just a great job right here. That one touch. Now he dumps it around to Bavillia. Penalty's over. Canucks are now one for six on the power play. Garland, Mikheyev, Bavillia, and he couldn't get a shot away. Peronic, pass back. Susi takes a look, lets it go. He scores! <laughs> Coaster ride continues. Carson Soucy ties the game at three. Just zips this one again. Good board work here. Win a battle. You can see Garland just takes that hit to make a play. Funnel to the front of the net. Little too much time and space here. The Rangers are a closing team. But the puck comes back to Soucy. He looks up and just blasts this one. Has time to get it by. That's the important. Look at the screen in front. Garland's there. You're going to see the flyby screen as Shesterkin goes down. He knows it's going to the glove hand side. Who risks the puck around the Vancouver zone. Kreider bumped by Hironik, but Kreider's up with the puck. Sends it back. Truba shoots to Smith the save. Rebound off the side of the goal by Chris Kreider. And both teams, and here's the shot from Truba. A pretty good rebound. Kreider brings it to the backhand, and it's that little flailing stick at the last second. I think the fans got their money's worth tonight. As time runs out, back and forth they win in the third period. And this game will go to overtime, tied at three. The nightcap, coast to coast on hockey night. And if you're in the East, and I know some of you are, glad you stayed up late for this one. It's been a dynamite finish to the third period. Ahead to Patterson. Elias Patterson steps over the Ranger line, leaves for Quinn Hughes. Cuts in front, he shoots, and a blocker save by Shesterkin. Wow. Kuzmenko turning with the puck. Hughes heads to the bench, replaced by Hironik. Here's Pedersen. His wrist shot blocked. Kuzmenko leaves the loose puck for Pedersen. Drops off to Kuzmenko. He's got some room. Puts it between the legs. Deeks. Left save. Another save. Two stops with the glove by Igor Shesterkin after a dandy move by Andre Kuzmenko. And then the little dangle between the legs, backhand to forehand elevation, the big glove hand save, and then the sprawl at the end. Is this puck, after it goes off the glove, is there for a split second. Now leads for Pedersen. He was tripped up as he put the puck between the legs. Play goes on. Three Rangers up ice. Kreider slows, cuts to the net. Centers, they score. Keandre Miller. And 
and the fans are not happy. They thought that Pedersen was tripped, but the Rangers went three on one the other way, and Keandre Miller at 3.48 of overtime ends it. The Rangers win four to three.